Alright you guys, I'm back. I didn't actually go anywhere again. Doing my back-to-back -back segments. So we're gonna tackle Death Peak now. See, it's, it's so annoying when you talk to the first guy because all the other trees you have to hold up to keep from moving backwards. But after you talk to him, you just have to let go completely. And I always forget that. There's a power tab, I believe, on the right over here. Or some type of tab. I, yeah, there we go. Useless tab. I have no use for a power tab, but why not grab it? We can get Frog just a little closer to maxing out his power nice and early. Alright. So, like, right now I'm holding up because you run slower here. So, like, right now I'm holding the dash button and I go that slow. So, holding up just keeps you straight. It's the same as when you're, like, on top of uh, the Blackbird Wings and in a section coming up soon. I believe the experience is going to be way higher than Vanilla starting now. Well, I don't know, Area Bomb. Does this do more than one enemy? Of course not. That does. This does. Hoo-wee! I just assume if any element's gonna work here, it's gonna be fire. Since, you know, I'm on an icy mountaintop. That didn't kill anything. Where the strategy guy though? Oh, these are crackers. They're not weak against anything. Since they might be weak against, uh... What do you call it? Shadow. The macabre. Supposedly weak against Shadow. This actually hurts pretty good, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I don't like that. Oh man. Bunch up, you guys. Bunch up for me. Excellent. Seems like a wasted bit of MP now. But it was only two because of the gold stud. Love me a gold stud. There we go. So next time I might fire tackle to just kill one of them. I don't know. I'll come up with. I'll come up with some system. I have two magic rings now. Only I had use for the other one. I kind of like having Luca with me too, because during the lava spawn fights, all of their big ass attacks are uh, physical, and I'll have protect with me now. Aha, you like that? You like that dodge? Ooh, I'm, I'm a elite dodger, man. Two wall rings now. I like this place. I'm going to save just because there's a lava spawn coming up. And never underestimate my ability to die in this game. Here's a way to skip this fight. I found it. Awesome. Don't think there's a way to get that treasure. Magus is on tonic duty. Luke is on protect duty. Robo's on actually doing damage duty. Probably put it on her, most importantly. Oh, fuck. That's gonna make it tough. How much damage is Uzi Punch even gonna do? Just curious. So... Change of strat needed. That's pretty good damage. Um, I'm gonna reset. Glad I just saved now. Okay, so I need more defense or more HP or both. Uh, Lowdown would give him more. Not a meaningful amount more, but more. Um, and then he has no use for physically attacking in this battle. And she has no use for magic defense in this battle. He has a magic defense attack, but I mean, it just kills you. Unless, I, th I think it's an element. I think I'm going to get her to 143. Her the silver earring. Where'd it go? I know it's in here. Earring. There it is. I'll give you the gold earring. Leave you as you were. You're fine. Although, if anything... I want the extra power, or do I just want to leave him fast? I think I just want him fast. Yeah, let's go with this.
Whatever, I got some to spare. Could've just used a shelter, but I'm too good for that. Let's save it like... Well, let's just do a save state. In case I decided I didn't want to waste all those tonics for some reason. Alright, Operation Survive this time. Did I actually get that off on time? Who needs it the most? Uh, probably now that I have the earrings on, Robo. Alright, so basically, Robo needs to be 600, Luca 650, and Magus 700. Got it. Oh, but with those, I don't need it that high. Whatever, I'm gonna figure this out as I go. How much is heal beam gonna give me? Probably not enough. Absolutely not. Let's see, I want you to die the least since I already took the time to cast Protect on you. I don't want you dying on me. Do you next. Chance will heal you next. So now I'm going to hope with my protect status, Magus can keep up with the healing, but we'll find out. That attack is what I was worried about. No, it's not. There's another one. That's a water attack. It might just be the lava spawn that you fight in the, uh, uh, what do you call it? Um, Black Omen. So I'm testing a fire tackle. That's it. That's what I was thinking of. Holy shit. I'm going to honor that since technically I can't just say, oh, I knew she was going to die and take my safe state back. Try to make it as little like cheating as possible. And status. Fuck. Okay. <sighs> so I didn't have to waste all those turns getting protect up when I did this last time. Um, that protects status. She has status protection. You can't. I don't have a memory cap, which is what I really need. One person isn't going to have it. Um, fuck, he needs that gold earring just to survive. I really want to bring Magus because he needs the tech points the most. Just gonna go make this work. No, I just need to be... And none of these do that ain't what I need, so... Like, I really need to put the amulet on somebody. I could put it on Robo. They need to be just slow as shit. Which I don't want either. So I think we're gonna see what happens again. Oh. I'm just gonna go back to where I was. Like, just so I'm being honest here. Right, so she dies. So I need to get her up quickly. Do one of these. Let's get some fucking damage on this guy. Okay, now I have to do something good. Heal, Magus. I don't think I got it off on time, though. Oh, I did. It's gonna kill Luca for sure. Ugh, I may just not be able to use this team. I may need Moral for haste and better healing. I'm wasting all our Robo's turns attacking. Okay, where'd he go? Full tonic. Make sure Luca doesn't die. 
I'm picking Luka because she's more resilient than Magus, surprisingly. I probably should have gotten him back up to full. See how much damage this does. Ooh, I like it. I never got... Protect is already worn off. Oh, dear God. All right. <laughs> uh, I think I have a way to beat this guy at all. I bring Marl and Robo, and I can full heal everybody in every turn as long as I can get HP back up. Robo could have the amulet, Marl could have one of the Aeon equipments, Luca could have the other if I bring Luca, but I'd rather not bring Luca. I ain't gotta be so weak, man. Marl could also put haste on people. I know it's stupid to bring Magus because it's gonna make this fight take longer, but I really want him to get the experience, and I really wish I'd bought his better weapon now. So I don't protect, I can just give them both to her. Now I've got someone who doesn't have status protection. Maybe that's okay. their HP is close. Um, yeah, I can't give you the power ring, can I? This may very well take for fucking ever, but we'll see what happens. I really feel like burning some of those. Okay. This seems a better chance. I can actually learn Spin Strike. If I wanted to go to prehistory to get the rock to cast it, with which to cast it. Seriously, how did I skip these guys the first time, but I can't do it since? Please don't heal him. Just trying to end this fight quickly. Thank you. That's what I was looking for. Ha. Marl's so strong. Okay, pathetic strat attempt number two. Alright. Just a second. Alright, that was quick. Just answering some tel telephone messages. <sighs> Oh my god. This could take a lifetime. See anything like, if I'm gonna use Magus for much of the rest of the game, I don't like these tech points aren't necessary. Let's see how long this takes. I'll try to supplement it when I can. He doesn't appear to be very fast. Ooh, I could be casting haste on people when I have downtime. Maybe I should go for that next time. <laughs> Assuming I die already. 
confidence in this one. That attack. Luckily, Magus is the one to target. Like, that does not bother me at all. Because he's the easiest one to get up. Really, I mean, really anyone but Marl is the easiest one to get up. Just because Marl is the one with Cure, too. That's annoying. But workable. Oh, she has perfect. That's right. Let's do this. I don't know why I cast it on Robo instead of Marl. I guess I was thinking I wanted to get chances to use some Uzi punches. Alright, perfect. So I'll use Cure Touch and I'll be fine. Alright, sorry, I'm not very talkative. There's not much going on here. There we go. There's that extra turn I was talking about. Put Magus out since he's weak as shit. Needs more speed! Perfect. I like that. It's my favorite attack he does. Single target. Doesn't kill anybody. Doesn't cause any negative status. I can totally out cure it. Do that already better. It's like it never happened. I wish it's so like why didn't they let the cursor default? Like, remember where I put it, damn it. I want to I want to attack that damn head every time. I have to physically move it myself. Life is so hard for me. Okay, moving on. That's annoying, but that's the right target to do that. If, she, if he's going to use that attack on Marl, that's probably the least damaging attack he can do. I'm not worried about using the full ethers because later I'll be able to buy them anyway. Alright Robo, fill back up quickly please. Your presence is needed. Healed and I hit him. Yay. Oh, pop. That wasn't too bad. I'm glad I didn't go level. Oh, did you see that experience? You know, 120 attack points? My goodness. Two Mara level ups. Wow. That was intense. And Robo will be even stronger next time. I forgot Robo had status protection. Gosh, that attack happened so rarely, I almost... <laughs> it never did it on Magus, the one person it could have hurt. Oh well. So Luca wasn't using any of that equipment, so I'm just going to leave Marla as she is, so I can bring her back for the next spawn fight. I don't have to swap anything out on her. just have to switch the gold stud for the silver earring, and the amulet for the dash ring. That's it. Pretty simple. Everyone looks good. I'm so tempted to go back and save. <laughs> I don't want to fight that again. Pussy. And I'm I'm actually going to use a shelter to restore my MPs. How much MP does Luca have? Luca's almost full. Marl needs it more. Come here, you, you gorgeous girl, you. Man, they, they get around fast. Like, <laughs> there's you know zero effort for switching party members. It's actually rather. I prefer that method. I don't really like the whole 
Like in Final Fantasy VI, you have to get on the airship and talk to whoever you're trying to bring back in. That's just... Like, it doesn't add anything to the game. It just gives you extra chores to do. Gaming shouldn't be a chore. It should be a pleasure. I know my, my pants are a little wet just thinking about it. That other chest is a new weapon for Magus. And for those of you who played this game, I am I have a general idea of how to skip some of these encounters in this area. You notice I've skipped like a lot that could have just happened right there. Because I'm so pro at this game. I'm not certain how to skip this next one and get the chest, so I might just let it happen. Who? I did it anyway. And you just have to remember to divert to the side. Oh, that gives him defense too. That is a nice boost. Okay, we're actually already at the uh, next fight, the next spawn fight. Swap that out for that. You can get the amulet instead, and then Luca goes out. Uh, Luca goes out, Marl goes in. And we're ready. So, oh! I think I forgot to max out his HP after I put that ring on. Fuck. That's okay. Goodbye. I got you, Magus. more than I would have expected. Fuck. That didn't happen last time. You know this turns off fast. Alright, Marl. I need you to fill up in time to take a turn. Trying to decide if it was worth using that heal on him, because if he gets hit again, he dies anyway. But whatever. Just getting damage on, that's all. Yeah, there we go. Ah, uh, starting from behind. Come on, sprain rate, come back. Alright. Okay. That was dumb. I need to be full on everybody. Shit. I might just throw this one away. God damn it. It's annoying. Making poor decisions, people. This is not hard. I had it down last time. I had some bad luck. Namely him killing Marl. Confusing Magus. I haven't been able to get haste up. That's one of the things that's bothering me. Let's do this. Mother fucking god. Shit. Oh, that doesn't get chaos every time, I guess. That's lucky. Can't catch up. Can't get back on top. There we go. Back. Come on, frame right. Do it. There you go. Why does it be? Why does that have to be a jerk sometimes? Everyone lives. Yes. Yes. Okay. I don't have much HP. God, I really want to get some Uzi punches off. It's busy fucking around over here. Okay. Needs more haste. 
need to be fast up. Of course, he'll probably kill Robo or Marl right now. Ruin all my hard work. What are you gonna do? Yes! Perfect. Yeah. Suck on that, punk. I want you dead! Perfect. Perfect! Perfect. See if it comes back if I don't do anything. Curious. Slow motion. There it goes. I like that. Bad timing. Robo's gonna finish him off anyway. I don't have anything to worry about. Check this. Damn it. <laughs> Trying for some positive reinforcement techniques. Didn't work. God. Why? Okay, Robo, this time you're gonna do it, right? Why is it doing that so much lately? It's like he forgets how to get out of frame skipping. Anyway, I wouldn't frame skip so much, but these fights are so repetitive. Loads. Area bomb, yay! Which I believe doesn't means Robo is not in last place anymore. I believe that honor belongs to. Frog now. Frog and Luca. Which is okay, because I like using Frog more than Robo. So we're going to switch you with you, and you with you, and... I guess still doesn't have Dark Bomb. They did buff Dark Bomb a lot, so I mean, it kind of makes sense that it's harder to learn. Still. Gold stud. Yeah. Power ring. Where you at? Give up your... You don't need any... You don't need to give anything up. You need to. Probably. You need to keep the amulet. Hmm. Actually makes Magus' attack seem better than I thought. I guess it's just that he doesn't have any... text to go along with it. Like all of his texts depend on his magic stat. What was I trying to think of? Oh, I wanted to see what Isla's attack was, 152. Robo's 165, he's the highest one. He's got no power tabs to his name. Neither does Isla. So in this section, you just have to not fall off. And the game just lightly pushes you downward. So you just, you kind of have to point the keypad, D-pad in the not exact direction you want to go. That's what makes it a little tricky. Pretty nervous. So I should have gone back and saved. Oh, nice, Luca. That's pretty decent damage. Don't forget, there's one guy down there. <laughs> I didn't think that was enough. Alright. I think I need one more fire, two, maybe two, and I'll be dead. Faster! Just don't take Magus. Don't take Luca again. I think I got it. This was probably one of the best places to get tech points because it's repeatable. You just walk to the last screen and come back in vanilla. And in this one, it's probably the fastest place to get experience points because 
you see I got 3,000 for that fight. That's more than I was getting for most boss fights not too long ago. Now if I thought they were close to like, like if one, if two of those fire twos was on the verge of killing them, I would definitely give Magus that other magic ring. But I don't think it is. I'll try to have Magus go first this time though, so I don't waste as much MP. I could cast water too to finish them off. <laughs> I don't know if it would finish them off. I do know it costs 8 MP. Wish I knew Cure 2 now, don't I? Boom, boom. 2268, that's so many experience points. Let's see who does more damage. Magus is Fire 2 or Luca's Napalm. They have almost identical magic numbers. 446. Or three something. I'm not so sure Napalm is stronger now. How much does this do? Yeah. Alright, check that. Good lord, all these in a row. I left work a little early because it was a slow day and I just wasn't feeling like doing much work. So sure enough, I get home, my phone starts blowing up. <sighs> People annoy me. I'm an old man. I'm annoyed by people. Oh my god, another lava spawn. It's like the only enemy up here. <sighs> What's a dark helm give me? Ooh. Okay. Um, we're going to switch out some more. We're going to bring these two back. Not because I need them, but because that strategy seems to work. Go back to giving you the silver earring. Uh, Frogman, sorry bud. It was a good ride. You're fine, you're fine. Amulet, Just whatever maxes out his defense. That's all I want. Gosh, Magus' stamina is so low. It's like down with the chicas. Ah, oh, let's do this again. I do wish Magus had a magic spell that was single target, like, no matter what. That'd be kind of nice. Look, I'm not going to start off with somebody being dead this time. This might go better. Alright. That's doing 999 now. Good to know. You got Lavos. What's up your sleeve? Nothing good, that's for sure. I wonder if I put Robo where Marl is if he'd be in range for Area Bomb. I don't think so, nor do I think it would do as much damage. Yeah. Oh! Fuck! Robo has no magic defense. Didn't think that through. Then I took a turn with Magus, that was foolish. That went badly really quickly. Once again though, I didn't kill the most important person here. 
Yeah, I probably should have given Robo some type of, you know, magic defense to go along with it. Alright, and fill her up, and just top off that HP. Fuck, please don't die. I've 60, god damn it. So close. It's the same speed as her. I don't feel like heal beam would really help me all that much. Back in it. Frog's uh, dual cure attack with Marl is called double cure, and it's way better because it also restores your status. And it requires cure 2 and cure 2, which costs the same amount of MP as heal beam and cure 2, I think. Cure 2 might cost 5, I can't remember for sure. I'll have to find out. Do your turn. Thank you. Cure 2 costs 4, so it costs the same amount as Heal Beam. Alright, don't attack Robo, don't attack Robo, don't attack Robo. Attack everybody, okay. Oh, he almost lived too. If I... Something potentially stupid. If he uses a sleep attack, anyone's dead. If I cure Magus now, he'll survive any other attack at least. This could be a poor idea, like just a terrible idea. We'll find out. Needs to have haste. I'm not sure that Marl would have survived that, actually. I think I should be very glad that that hit who it hit. Actually, I, I didn't look at it closely, but I think Heal Beam might have only cost three. Let's look at it next time. Don't know why I'm so curious. Oh, worst case scenario. You asshole. God damn it. Okay, my phone needs to stop bothering me. What was happening when I left? <gasps> Marl's in danger! A little bit extreme, yes, but I'm tired of this fight. I don't want to do it again. Okay. It's probably like one Uzi punch from dying and I'm wasting my turns, but whatever! Nope, totally worth it. <laughs> Everyone's alive for a change. Everyone's about to be full HP again. Yeah, four and four. I take it back. Take back what I said about heal beam being three. Heal frogs. Heal all spell is three. I think. <laughs> Probably wrong about that too. Wrong about all kinds of things these days. Just chill. He's almost dead. Nah, don't just chill. So the reason why I switched back out to cast haste first, I've mentioned this before, but in case you missed it, it doesn't actually take effect until after your next turn. So you want to use it right before the person that you're casting it on takes their action. That way they have haste right away, basically.
This one, this lava spawn is being extra pesky. But I think this will kill it. Damn it. My positive outlook isn't working. Fuck me. I don't think Cure Beam's getting healer enough to be worth my while. I'm not sure if Full Tonic's going to either, but I think Robo can get another turn off. He can. Robo needs some etherage. No chaos. Thank you. Okay, we're gonna go mid ethers. I do think I'm almost there. Model's gonna re up haste. Robo's gonna cure Magus. Very good. Yeah, he'll be back in time. Because he's hasted, I'm comfortable doing that. I think he'll get another turn in time. God, I wish I knew how much HP he had that whole time. Could have saved myself a lot of like, extra effort. Hey! Marl is done learning text. She's second to finish. That's crooked. Alright, let's go over a little further. That's close enough, right? Yeah, there you go. Chest here, you can't miss it. Could've used that in that fight. Oh, memory lock. I thought it protected against confusion. Never mind. We're at the summit. What will happen when we do this? Poor Magus, like why didn't we get a Shala clone while we're at it? I mean it's really just a doll. I feel like that's gotta be a mistranslation. Like gosh, why not? Just get Shala there. It's kinda cool, the game remembers who you were using at that point. So they've got Frog and Luca right there. Instead of two random characters, the two that you're using now. Okay, Chrono's gonna be back. We're all happy. Marl and him are gonna bone on the top of this mountain. Chopper shrinkage, my friend. All right, he's explaining all the uh, side quests we can do. Good Lord, how much does he say? Good God. Okay, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna call it a segment, a rather sloppy one at that, and get ready for tennis. Later, everybody. Bye. <laughs>